Dianaea mishipula are commonly called Venus flytrap is a genus of perennial, insectivorous, rosette-forming plants that are native only to a small region of North and South Carolina. It is the most widely recognized carnivorous plant species on Earth. This plant is a monotypic genus meaning it is the only species in its genus. It belongs to the Drosraceae family which includes the waterwheel plant and sundews. The plant's common name Venus flytrap was derived from the English translation of its genus and species name. Dionea, daughter of Dion, refers to the goddess Venus, while the species name Mishipula translates to flytrap. Venus flytrap is winter hardy in USDA zones 7 to 10, but with adequate winter protection may also survive winters in USDA zones 5 and 6. These plants are usually found in boggy sites in marshlands, wet grasslands and savannas. But they may be grown in containers, terrariums and greenhouses. Venus flytraps grow from a bulb-like rootstock which produces a low-growing rosette with as many as eight green basil leaves. And each leaf has a specialized structure, which traps unsuspecting insects. The plant produces white flowers in spring. To grow Venus flytraps indoors, choose a container that is right for your climate. In USDA zones 7 or lower, consider using a terrarium. This will trap in the heat and moisture to help the plant thrive. Do not plant it in a fully enclosed container as airflow is essential to the plant. In USDA zones 8 or higher, using a regular clay pot will work fine. Venus flytrap will thrive in poor soil. Use a mixture of sand and peat moss for best results. Place your pot in a location that gets at least 6 hours of direct sun each day during the growing season from spring to fall. If the plant is not getting enough sunshine, it can be grown under grow lamp for 12 hours each day. Keep the lamp at least 4 to 7 inches above the plant. For plants grown in a terrarium, make sure it doesn't get burned in the sun. Venus flytraps have a natural dormancy period during the winter season. It usually lasts from early fall to early spring. During this time, the Venus flytrap should be kept at a temperature of 35 to 50 degrees Fahrenheit, 2 to 10 degrees Celsius, with less sunlight than it receives during the summer months. Water Venus flytraps regularly to keep the soil moist. But make sure the plant is not kept in standing water as this will result in rot. It is best to use rainwater, distilled water, or reverse osmosis water. Do not use tap water because it is usually too alkaline heavy, and may contain too many minerals that may harm the plant. Venus flytraps thrive in poor soil, so do not fertilize the plant. Feed the plants with insects, spiders or mealworms instead, because they use the nitrogen-rich insect protein to nourish itself. Venus flytraps can be propagated by seeds but it will take a few years for the plant to mature. It is best to purchase the plants from reputable nurseries. It is illegal to take Venus flytraps from the wild because it is highly endangered. Thank you for watching.